that the first step to getting your skin right is water so make sure we are 2019 2020 no more drinking soda no more drinking juices sticking to the water or these organic juices or some shit you know you know <laughs> to the channel you guys so i know i said that i was gonna record the sipping tea with bougie b video but honestly i'm still kind of annoyed that it all got deleted so i'm just gonna say fuck it and start moving on to the next video and i still i promise i will still record that one i'm just you know still estoy enojona and no quiero hacerlo otra vez ahorita so you know i'm just a little a little bitter about it. for today i kind of just wanted to do like a little skincare like the products that i've been loving this year just because you know Everybody in college, their skin can get stressed out when because we're like going through exam midterms or whatever you're going through. Even if you're not in school, like sometimes work can be stressful and you know, sometimes the skin can break out or you just want to make sure you maintain it, you know? So I just decided I'm going to share kind of like the ones that I've been liking so far. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Um, first of all, one that I've been starting to use is actually this one. So this is gonna be like a little at home remedy. I know it looks weird right now because it's all like todo liquid ahorita, um, but it does get kind of more like moldy, not moldy, but like you know like spongy once it settles in, and then that's when you can scrub it onto your face. Um, but this is basically a whole aloe vera plant, so you can literally get those anywhere. I'm pretty sure. Like I've been to, I got mine at Fresh Time. So Fresh Time actually sells them for like $1.99, which is actually not bad because there's other places that sell it for like three, four dollars. So I was just like <laughs> clutch. Um, so Fresh Time is definitely gonna be the new spot for that one. But yeah, so for this one, I literally just get like the whole aloe vera plant. Oh, I should have recorded it for you guys so you guys could see it because it was like a whole process just porque todo el jugo y todo se estaba saliendo. But you literally just like cut it in half and then on the inside, it's like a little spongy substance. Um, just for those people that don't know what it is, like it is kind of more like a, it's like a clear spongy. I'm, everyone knows aloe vera if you've gotten burned or, I don't know, I feel like everybody knows what aloe vera is. I pretty much just put it in a blender and then my mom is huge on essential oils. So I just go in through her little stash and I get, um, sorry mom if you're seeing this, but like I get the lemon one and no, sorry, I get lavender and tea tree oil. I, I saw it on Pinterest or like I saw it somewhere online where I was just like, ooh, a little combo. So I just put like a little like lavender for like the calmness to like make sure you're not stressed or whatever. And then the tea tree oil is just like really good for your skin. So I kind of just put it in a blender, mix it up, and then I just put it in a little like mason jar or big mason jar. Um, and then I just put it in the fridge. Oh. I was like, do I have a ghost in here? A little Daisy Marquez moment. But yeah, so that's it. That's it for this one. Then this one I just pretty much put in on my face, wash it off. You can kind of use it maybe as a scrub too if you want it. Depends on you, but I kind of use it as a mask. Um, aloe vera is actually really good for your hair too, so I kind of like it because you can either use it for your skin or your hair, and it's kind of like a little, a little two-in-one combo. So you know, we love that. Um, the next ones that I use, I'm gonna talk about the scrubs that I use um this one is literally my favorite one it is the coffee cup face and body mask from lush so it's literally just like a little it comes in a little black container and it's literally coffee beans or it looks like like se ve todo de cafe y todo right now but it's just literally coffee beans and bitch it smells like coffee beans so that's why i love it too because it's literally like a little like huele bueno like when you're washing your face but that's just like a scrub so like you can use it on your body too obviously um, but I use it mostly on my face um, for like every other day. I don't like to use a scrub like every day, but I really like it, especially when you forget to wash your face off, which, you know, I know, I know, I know to come for me. Sometimes I just, uh, I fall asleep and I know that's so bad, but um, my other one too, I, this is the only sample I have of it because I literally just ran out of the big one, but this is Dark Angels. This is literally just like a little, casi ni tengo ya, like, ya se me fue todo, but it's literally just like a black scrub. It's like a little charcoal like texture and then you put that all over your face, bitch. I love that one for when um like when I'm gonna go for my no makeup days. I literally just take off my makeup, do whatever, and then I go into the shower and put my scrub. When I do the scrub, the coffee scrub combo with the Dark Angels um charcoal one, I love it because then it leaves your skin more like it cleans out all your pores entirely and it kind of makes it like more skin tight. So it feels like 
I don't know, like filtered it or something, you know, in a way, like even if you're not wearing makeup. But, um, the thing that I also like to use after that is toner, and I like to use the tea tree water. Again, I just like, that. the tea tree is kind of what I put in here, this one too, for like the little um, at-home remedy. Um, I just love tea tree oil. Uh, that's what I've seen that helped my skin kind of improve or like stay maintained. So the tea tree oil is literally just this. This one was probably like $21, I think. Actually, I don't even know. I'm pretty sure it's $21 because I got the bigger one. Um, but again, like I feel like the bigger ones actually last me a long time because this coffee scrub, I still have like up to here. So this is still like a good amount. And I bought this like four or six months ago. Like it still lasts me like a long time because you don't need like a lot of your scrub. You don't need to like doubt the whole thing on you. But it just like always lasts for me when I get the bigger ones, so I just get the bigger ones instead of having to make trips. Um, another basic bitch, you know, like everyone loves their little Mario sprays, so I have, I get the trio ones where it's like, the green ones in my other bag because I take that one everywhere I go. Um, these ones are just good. See, this one has lavender and stuff, so again, that's why I put it in my actual like aloe vera rem remedy too. Um, and this one has aloe herbs and rose water. Mario sprays are just good for like whenever, like especially when it's during the day and I notice that I'm starting to get oily or something, I just kind of like <laughs> spritz, 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 spritz. And we're good, we're back to we're back to going, back to the dry matte slash dewy skin kind of look. That's why I like it, cause it doesn't like fully make you matte, bitch. The one, the one, okay, I'm gonna show you my favorite. My all time favorite mask. Like this is the one this that- This is the one that literally I felt like cleared my entire skin that I feel like good going out with no makeup days because this one like really makes sure my skin is like always super clear and like this was just the one product that I know for sure like hands down I will continue to and it is the glam glow mask the glam glow I'm pretty sure everyone knows about it like it just works wonders like it honestly does like I feel like it clears up your skin this one's literally just like a little um it is like a little black gray kind of like clay mask kind of I thing. Love, this is a super mud cleaning treatment um so i absolutely love 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 this one but with this one i love to get the moisturizer i have that one in my car actually though because i take that one literally everywhere i go like that's my all-time favorite moisturizer like i was gonna show you guys this clinique one but honestly fuck that one like clinique is still good you know i still love her whatever but that one is literally my all-time favorite one so it's like a little pink little bottle kind of thing um but it it's like a moisturizer and highlighter in one yes bitch a highlighter and moisturizer in one i literally just apply that after i use this one i love to use the combo again after i use this i use this one still like every day like this one's my favorite one and then the moisturizer i just put over one especially when i'm not gonna wear any makeup and i love it because even when you turn to the side like you know how you get the highlight glow when you turn to the sides that's literally what that moisturizer does like it just makes your skin super like cute and it's like no makeup like so it's not gonna clear up your or clog up your pores or anything it's literally just moisturizing your skin but it gives you the highlight effect bitch so that's why i love that one especially for my no makeup days like mwah, chef's kiss for that one whoever like the owners of glam glow like y'all snapped with that one chef's kiss is all around um but yeah like and the ultimate like you know the regular twitter bitches what they say is like <laughs> water like yes make sure you're always drinking water because a that's just good for your health because you know we don't fuck with people who have yellow pee period but um also just because it helps with your skin like it really does that's what i've noticed like make sure that like my skin doesn't completely break out is making sure that i'm always drinking water so mm -hmm. this one's my favorite this one i just love because it matches with the fits right now because i lost my starbucks crystal one so you know like the little pink holiday one that has like the little like diamonds all over yeah i lost her porque love that for myself anywho that was just a few of my favorite 2019 fall skincare products um for 2020 i'll probably update you guys i'm probably gonna keep using the glam glow honestly though on the coffee one so i'll probably just incorporate just a few other ones but i don't like to go over crazy with my skincare because to do that every night like you have to make sure you're like on it and i don't like to get too crazy with over changing shit on my skin you know but...